All right, guys, we are back with Atlier Poetry. <sighs> I just need to turn in this little quest. I'm gonna go explore the map. Okay, so unless I can literally fight that thing, I can't get all the points here. I'm dumb. There's no way I can fight that thing. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. Oh, 
Kijik or treat. Cool. this time. <laughs> I got it, guys. I got it. Now I can just goof off till the end of the year. Thank God. Now comes the confirmation. This is important, so I have to check everything over very thoroughly. Yes. Of course. Oh, this is nerve-wracking. Are you done yet, Quirk? All right, you're good. Really? So you mean my license will get an extension? Yeah, it's a done deal. Congratulations, you did well. We did it, guys. Thank you so much. I feel so tired all of a sudden. Snap out of it! It's not over yet! Now then, do you remember the letter I sent you earlier? Um, yes. About coming here on the day my current license expires. Good. I'm glad you remembered. I'll give you a new license then, so be sure to show up. Um, Cordelia? What? Is it really going to be okay? You won't tell me I don't have enough points on that day, will you? Of course not. You don't have to worry about that. Uh, I'm sorry. I can't stop worrying. Well, I'll come back on the last day. Sure. You probably had back-to-back -back adventures until now. So try relaxing for a change. Thank you. still working hard as an adventurer. Of course I am. You should know since you go on adventures with me. But when I see my rank go up, it tells me I'm one step closer to being a first-rate adventurer. First-rate adventurer. Ha! You don't stand a chance against me. Wait, let me see that. Huh? What? Why are you outranking me? I am? Really? <laughs> Stop making that sickening face! This can't be right! It has to be a mistake! What's wrong with it? I worked really hard for that. You mean to say I haven't? I've worked tens, no, hundreds of times harder than you! I never said you didn't. Why are you mad at me? I was just... I don't believe it. It's a mistake. A Schwarzlong cannot possibly lose to some redneck. But it's not my fault. I just outrank you. 
Oh, now you're talking back to me. You think you're superior once you've attained a higher rank? You always say you're better than me. Saying Schwarzlong family this or Schwarzlong family that. But that's true. What's wrong with saying that? Cordelia told me an aristocrat's title doesn't mean much. <laughs> Keep going, and I'll be furious. You are both aristocrats, but Cordelia is so much nicer. You always brag and act mean. Shut up! You're the daughter of the greatest adventurer and the student of an amazing alchemist. I have nothing but my title. You must see me as someone petty. That's not true. I never thought of you like that. I hate you! Mimi! Thanks for making a scene at my workplace. Why couldn't you take it elsewhere? I didn't mean to say all that. Why did I... Calm down. You just wanted your best friend to compliment you, right? I thought Mimi would congratulate me. But she... There, there. Don't cry. I know she's in the wrong here. But you also went a bit too far. What should I do? Mimi hates me now. She said it in the spur of the moment. She doesn't mean it. But... but... Oh, jeez. You're such a handful. I'll deal with her. Just stop crying. Can you do anything about her? Of course. What? You don't trust me? I do. Thank you. Good. Now go home for today. Have a good night's sleep, and you might feel better tomorrow. Okay. Jeez. I'll get Rorona to talk with her. What should I do with that troublesome little girl? Why are you randomly there? to intrude while you're working, but I need a favor. Do we have a guess? Well, what's wrong, teacher? Well, he's exceedingly ex... Oh. You haven't changed one bit. Long time no see. You know each other? Not exactly. We're simply acquainted. Totary, why are you friends with this Mimi? Mimi? I was merely being competitive as a scientist to defend our pride against alchemy. Oh, I see. You did the same things to teach her. Now I know it was my misunderstanding. For that, I apologize. As you can see, I'm good friends with your student. So how about letting bygones be bygones? You gave a really long name for me, but Totary gets to call you Mark? Totary, that's so not fair. Huh? Why are you yelling at me? Then you can call me Mark as well. I only did it because you refused to stop calling me Briny. I despise it. Anyone called Briny would... How'd you come up with that name? 
He's Mark McBride, so I just turned it into Briny. It's cute, right? I don't know about that. Why not? Of all people, I thought you'd understand. Seems as though we have a unanimous vote here. Now I have no reason to argue with you anymore. So, can I still call you Briny? That would be a no. See? He's still a meanie. There, there. Calm down, both of you. He might be weird, but Mark isn't a bad person. I think. Okay. If you say so, Totori. Let's leave it at that for today. I want to talk about work now. Oh, I'm sorry. That's why you're here. There is something I need. If you can make it as soon as possible, that would be great. I still think Briny is cute. All right. Now that I got a fancy new... Yeah! Uh, well, I was. But when you watch me, I get butterflies in my stomach. Why? What's there to be nervous about? I don't want to be nervous, but I just am. I want to watch you synthesize. I know. Why don't we do it together? Together? Is that possible? We've never tried it before, but I'm sure we can do it. We'll mix the cauldron together. It'll be fun. Together. That does sound like fun. Let's do it. Yeah. I wanted to start with a supplement. That, huh? Here are the ingredients. Let's start. Sure. That was fast. Wait, what's this, teacher? What do you mean? It's a supplement. Or not. It's a... Yeah, it's a pie. A pie made from a supplement. So, it's a sub-pie mint. That's not what I was asking. How did a pie come out anyway? I don't know. Wrong ingredients? Or I did it subconsciously because I'm hungry right now. That's a really big mistake. Sorry. I really am. I'll be more careful next time. Sure. All right. Let's start over. Let's see. Medicine. Let's make some medicine next. Medicine? Sure. What do you want to use as the ingredients? Let's do a really basic one so we don't make a mistake. This and this. All right. Look. Twirl, twirl, twirl. I think they just continuously make pies. Um, <laughs> another pie. Uh, I'll name it Meta Pie. One bite cures what ails you. What are you talking about? How did we make pie again? I... I don't know. But this might be a revolutionary discovery. If we synthesize together, everything turns into pies. But I don't want to make pies, teacher. You're just getting in the way. So you don't have to help anymore. <gasps> but I wanna... It's, it's friggin' hilarious. Anyways, supplement. Like it's my fault. Well, then again, it is. Hmm. 
Mimi? Ah! R Rona! What are you doing there? Come on in! Totori's inside! No, not now. Oh, right. You two are still fighting. Totori said she wanted to apologize. She has nothing to apologize for. I... I just can't see her right now. That means you eventually will, right? Yes. So please don't tell her I was... Sure. I'll keep it a secret. I hope you'll see her soon. I'll try. Now if you'll excuse me... I'm her teacher, but I can't do anything for her when she needs it most. No point frowning over it. I just have to be sure to smile for Totori as much as I can. Yeah. Totori, I'm home! Where's Verona? She went to buy something at Tiffany's. I'm sure she'll be back soon. Oh, by the way, how does it feel to run a workshop together? It still feels a bit funny. I feel nervous and edgy all the time, but I also feel really happy. Oh, I'm so jealous. What was that? Uh, nothing! Anyway, glad you're happy. Yes, it's all thanks to you. call you that. That's because it's special because you're the only one who calls me that. Just me? Special? Jeez, stop making me say these things. I take it back. <laughs> Corey, you're so cute. Get off me and don't call me cute. You're so, so cute. Let me go. Stop making that stupid grin. No fair. They're having fun. I wish I had a girl childhood friend.
I'm just gonna sit here and make shit. If I can, anyways. something. What is it? It's about this container. The one in my workshop has the same... Yeah! I connected the two. I thought it'd be convenient if you're using both workshops. Connected? You make it sound simple. What's wrong? Did I cause trouble because of it? No, no. Not at all. But how did you connect them? Our land is so far from my village. It's actually kind of hard to explain. But in simple terms, I went clamp. Clamp? Yeah, I took the two and went clamp. I'll tell you more when you know alchemy better. Clamp? Now I'm even more confused. Pass out. Okay. Six of them then.
sleep. Sorry guys, my cat is currently trying to lay on my lap.
all the books. tried talking with her. She seemed depressed, so I'm sure she regrets what she said. Really? Then we can... Well, about that. So... It's not that. It's just... Uh... 
Mimi, I'm sorry I said those terrible things to you. I didn't mean to say them, but... Stop it right there. Don't talk to me yet. You're still mad at me. What do I have to do for you to forgive me? I said don't talk to me. Here, that was fast. You know, you have a real troublesome personality. You can save your breath. Just... Yeah, yeah, let's see. Nothing worth congrats. Look at this. I see it. That's right. You see? When I put my mind to it, it's easy. A reason? A reason to... What? Listen and listen carefully. You now have no reason to look down. Sh sure. Good. Are you sure? I... It's fine. It was just... I still have to make this right. Huh? No. Yes, you did. I said I didn't. Hey, wait! She can be a huge pain. Hey, yeah, yeah. It's like the last day. Sorry, I didn't mean anything bad. Customers? People who stay until closing with one cup- Oh, I'm sorry. You have nothing to apologize about. It was short-sighted of me to think Setsi's popularity would save this place. In all seriousness, I may have to close shop at this rate. What? Your tap- Not right away. I need your tavern, Gerard. Those words make me very happy, but, uh, I know. How about you help me with something? I'll do anything. That's good to hear. What could it be lacking? The tavern lacks... Special? Right. I don't have anything. That's where you come... Make? Of course. I'm still too young, so I can't drink. I wouldn't... I know a lot about alcohol. So I thought... Me? I think that's... <laughs> it's better than doing nothing. But if I don't do it, you might go... Thank you. 
What's wrong? Yes, I've never heard you make those sexy sounds before. No! Sexy? I didn't know I was doing that! I'm kidding! Sex appeal is the last thing on anyone's mind when it comes to you. I know that's true, but it kinda hurts. What's up? If something's on your mind, you can talk to me. It's no biggie. It's just... What I'm doing isn't really different from before I became an adventurer. Isn't that fine? It means you were like an adventurer even before you had a license to prove it. Adventurers come in all forms, but we just do whatever we want. Just do whatever. Am I doing what I really want? Why are you asking me? Why do you want to become an adventurer in the first place? I wanted to find mom. And I also wanted to be a really great adventurer, just like her. <laughs> You're not making progress on either of those. Ugh, don't laugh. Sorry, I never imagined you'd want to be an adventurer like Gisela. What kind of adventurer was Mom? I don't really remember much about her. What do I gotta do to be an adventurer like her? Huh, I'm not sure how to answer you. I don't know that well either. During Gisela's rise to fame, most of my time was spent in our land. Oh. Sexy and Dad never really tell me stories about Mom. Maybe I'll ask around the village. Bye! See you later! I hate having to keep secrets, especially from little Totori. But there's no helping it given the circumstances. Zetsi told me to keep quiet, too. but I guess it can't hurt to try. You're making it so obvious you don't expect anything out of me. If you want something, I can try to help. Then, do you know about my mom back when she was an adventurer? Nope. I shouldn't have bought... Can you blame me? I'm not really interested. Gisela was more like a scary neighbor than an adventurer to me. Forget it. I didn't expect much anyway. Oh, come on. Does she... Maybe I should just tell her everything. Oh, but they'll definitely get mad at me for... What is it? Uh, just don't ask me for anything too strange or inappropriate. It's nothing weird. Oh. I want to be just like her, but I don't know what kind of adventurer she actually was. It's very like you, but I'm sorry. Uh, oh, really? It's the same for the whole village. She was the only one who became an adventurer at the time. None of us went with her on any adventures to see what she was like. Oh. Come on, don't look at me like that. I have other memories about her I can share with you. Really? I want to hear them. Don't expect much. They're very ordinary stories. I've worked here since I was young. Every time she came, she'd brag endlessly about her adventures. She bragged, huh? Yeah. She was talkative when sober, but it opened up a whole different can of worms when she drank. She talked about how she almost killed a bandit, or how she destroyed some ruins along with a monster inside it. She went on and on with trivial stories like that. Those don't sound trivial at all. But in the rare instance adventurers from outside the village visited, they all knew Gisela. They'd all say they were caught up in some trouble caused by her, and they complained on and on about it. But from the way they talked, it sounded like they had the time of their lives. They were happy even though they got caught up in trouble? Everything about her was reckless and beyond belief, but nobody held it against her. Then again, I'm one of those people. Did Mom do something to you, too? She never paid her tab, not even once. Thanks to her, I'm still in the red. Really? Don't bother. You couldn't even begin to chip away at it. I just take her stories as payment for the drinks. It's that much? How much is... Oh, wait, maybe I shouldn't ask. If by any chance she comes back, 
And I'll have her pay it in full. She'll be back. I'll definitely bring her back. I'm counting on you. That's probably all I can tell. Yes. <laughs> Glad to be of service. Oh, sorry to... Talked too much. I shouldn't get her hopes up like that. Welcome! Sorry, I'm not here to shop. Really? It's about my mom. Her name's Gisela. I was wondering if... Well? I haven't even... I guess you wouldn't know. I'm sorry. Oh, yeah! Tree. Oh! <laughs> Amazing! The fuck? What is <laughs> you didn't have to keep it. Thanks for asking! The Homunculus Automatic Creation Unit. Homunculus? Don't sweat the small stuff. Anyway, we homunculus and That's okay. First, open this part and insert some. That's it. Almost. Happy. Okay, 
Jim? Teacher, let's just call it a day. Jim! Jim! Alright, I'm gonna save. Alright, that's where I'm gonna stop for today, guys.